controversy surrounding the Black Madonna and Pope John Paul II arises from the fact that the Pope visited the Black Madonna of Chenstokoa in 1987, and the Times magazine reported that the image turned black due to a storm that had occurred some time ago. However, the Black Madonna has been a subject of interest for scholars and researchers, including Dr. Isep Ben Josh Annan of Cornell University. Dr. Annan suggested that the storm might not have been the sole reason for the image's darkening, implying that there might be other factors at play. Okay, uh, the present open. Pope is going back to Poland right. to worship at the statue of the Black Madonna and Child. That's in the New York Times. But what the Times says the next day, don't worry about the Black Madonna and the Child. She was originally white, but there was a storm in the 16th century passed by and, and, and turned it black. But the same storm must have gone to Spain and then it went to Ethiopia and it went to the Soviet Union and turned all the Black Madonnas back. It was a hell of a storm. Today, we're embarking on an enchanting journey to uncover the captivating tale of the Black Madonna and unveil the mystery behind her portrayal as a Black Virgin Mary. But wait, have you ever wondered why countless popes have made pilgrimages to kneel before her? Join us as we delve into this fascinating extra narrative. And before we plunge into the depths of this intriguing story, don't forget to spread the love, hit that like button, share and subscribe. Your support fuels our passion for bringing you more riveting stories. So, are you ready? Let's dive in together. The Black Madonna is a religious icon that has been the subject of much debate and controversy throughout history. It refers to statues or paintings in Western Christendom of the Blessed Virgin Mary and the Infant Jesus, where both figures are depicted with dark skin. The most commonly accepted theory deems the dark skin of the Madonna to be accidental, with the images once being white, but having darkened through aging and exposure to candle soot. Some black Madonnas depict Mary racially as a black woman, while others have darkened due to various physical factors or intentional artistic choices. Theories suggest that intentional darkening could be linked to illustrating texts like I am black but beautiful from the Song of Songs 156. However, some argue that the Black Madonna is linked to ancient pre-Christian religions, with the dark-skinned depiction being associated with divinities such as Cybele, Artemis, Gaia, and Isis, who are often portrayed as black. This theory suggests that black is not only a mystical color associated with fertile earth, but also an expression of an ancient cultural memory that connects us back to our early history in Africa. The Black Madonna of Częstochowa is a revered icon of the Virgin Mary, located in the Jasna Góra Monastery in Częstochowa, Poland. The icon is known for its dark color, which is believed to have resulted from exposure to devotional candles over time. However, there are also legends and traditions surrounding the icon's origins, including the belief that it was painted by Saint Luke on a tabletop made by Saint Joseph and that it was brought to Poland by Saint Helena in the 4th century. The icon has been a significant symbol of Polish nationalism, patriotism and religious liberty, particularly during times of conflict and invasion. For example, during the Swedish invasion of Poland in the 17th century, the Paulite monks at the Jasna Gora Monastery credited their success in repelling the invaders to the intercession of the Black Madonna. Pope John Paul II expressed his devotion to the Black Madonna during his visit to Poland in 1979. 
he made a profound statement that emphasized the significance of the Black Madonna in the context of Polish history, culture, and identity. He stated, During my previous pilgrimage to my homeland in 1979, I said at Jasna Gora that here we have always been free. It is difficult to express differently what the image of the Queen of Poland became for all Poles when, yes, here at Jasna Gora, there also rested the hope of the nation and the persevering effort towards the recovery of independence. This statement highlights the deep connection between the Black Madonna and the Polish people's struggle for independence and freedom. The story of the Black Madonna is closely intertwined with the history of Europe and its encounters with Africa. In medieval times, during the 5th century CE, Christianity began to spread through Europe due to the influence of the Eastern Roman Empire. During this period, images of the Virgin Mary and the infant Jesus were often depicted with dark skin, which is believed to have been a result of the influence of pre-Christian religions and the cultural memory of Africa as the cradle of humanity. However, when Europeans arrived in Africa in the 15th century, they brought with them the concept of the savior of all of mankind, doused down to the Africans before this time. The Arabs had introduced the northern parts of Africa and the Sahel to Islamic ideology, which was brought into Africa via the Trans-Saharan trade routes. The Europeans who introduced the transatlantic slave trade in the 15th century CE also brought in the Christian ideology which took root in Africa and eventually led to the emergence of the Black Madonna image. The depictions of Jesus Christ have also been a source of controversy, with Michelangelo's painting of Jesus in 1400 CE depicting him with Caucasoid features, including long hair, blue eyes and fair skin. This depiction, which became the ideal representation of Jesus for the Roman Church, contrasts sharply with the earlier depictions of Jesus as an Africoid type, which were common in the 2nd century CE. The visit of Pope Francis to Poland in 2016 further highlighted the significance of the Black Madonna in Polish culture and national identity. The Pope's visit was an opportunity for the Polish people to express their devotion to the Black Madonna and to celebrate their unique cultural heritage. The controversy surrounding the Black Madonna continues to this day, with conflicting views between the church, academics and researchers. Uh, most black people in Birmingham, Alabama, like in Harlem, New York, are Christians and they go to a, in a black community, a black minister, a black congregation, but with a white Jesus, because they didn't know that the, that Jesus, up until Pope, Mark, Pope Julius II, had the first black Jesus painted. He had Michelangelo to do it, but up until that time, the world worshipped the Black Madonna and Child. Some argue that the Black Madonna images are a result of accidental darkening, while others believe that there is a clear intention behind the blackness of the images found in hundreds of Catholic churches across Europe and Latin America. The Black Madonna is a complex and controversial religious icon, whether linked to ancient pre-Christian religions or simply a result of aging and exposure to candle soot, the Black Madonna remains a powerful symbol of national identity and religious devotion particularly in Poland. We're thrilled to have taken you on this captivating journey into the world of the Black Madonna. We hope the insights we've shared have left you intrigued and inspired, offering a fresh lens through which to view this fascinating topic. Now, we're eager to hear from you. What are your thoughts? 
Do you have any questions or reflections to add? Drop them in the comments section below. And if you found our exploration as riveting as we did, show us some love. Hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more enlightening content. By subscribing, you'll ensure you never miss out on our future adventures. Thank you for joining us on this journey and we eagerly anticipate welcoming you back for our next exploration. Until then, stay curious and keep discovering. See you in the next one.